Michael. You ready now? Yeah, I'm ready now. You sure? Yeah. I'm Lenny Wild from Newton, Kansas. I'm the RVP from Kansas for the American Truck Historic Society. This is one of my many internationals. It's a 1960 Sightliner, ACO 180. Uh, water last year at the Colorado Show. From Mrs. Skinner. She's from Reedsboro, Wisconsin. Her husband had it for about 15, 20 years, and I'll probably spend the next 15, 20 years sitting in my shed. It's a, <laughs> kind of a rare truck. It was made for tight quarters and longer trailers in the days of regulation where you couldn't have a very long trailer. All right. What has it got for a power plant? It's a 401 gas job with a, a five-speed, two-speed rear end. It's not very powerful. <laughs> The V8 is not real powerful compared to my 450 or 549 walk all over it. I really do think it was more of a city delivery truck than an over the road truck. Right. And the unique aspect, of course, is the glass in the front where you have a little better bit visibility it's down around the front bumper. Um, I remember in the early 60s, people that drove them didn't like them. Growing up in Minnesota, what I always heard is your feet frozen, and I can believe it. I, I don't know why, because I haven't driven it 30 miles yet. It's a, basically a very low mileage truck, and pretty original. Well, while we're here, let's talk about uh, the trailer and the load that you have on back here. you probably got a story on the tractors. Well. Not much of a story on the track. It was the trailer from 1945 Fruhoff. A friend of mine out in LA had, he wanted to get rid of it, so I hauled it along to a young guy that works for me part time. He's still in high school. The 52 Minneapolis Moline is actually a G, not a GB. You couldn't find a G sticker. I think the M International is a 47. The M International is a very popular truck. Tractor built from 1930 on for the next 30 some years. This is my newest truck, not newest in my collection, but the newest model. It's a 77 International 4070 with a 350 Cummins, Jake Brake, 13 speed. Uh, it's a very low mileage truck. It's 417,000 actual miles. Belonged to an elevator in Adrian, Minnesota. And then a farmer, uh, he used it about two months a year, and I bought it about five years ago. Just a very solid, very low original truck. Uh, white paint on its original, the other paint was yellow, bright yellow, I just repainted it red because it was faded. Thank mm -hmm. you.